What is up, YouTube? Uh, it's been a while since the last time I had an update for you guys. I think the last update I had was back in uh, just after 4th of July when I was working on the uh, old Hondo jet boat. And let me tell you, a lot has happened in the uh, last uh, six months or so that that happened. So let me give you a quick rundown of uh, everything that's been going on since then. Uh, about a month later in August, I had somebody that actually gave me an offer for the Hondo that I could not refuse and uh, I sold the Hondo for $6,000 and uh, originally I wasn't going to do that but I decided that uh, I kind of hit the limitations of the Jacuzzi YJ pump. It's a axial flow pump versus a mixed flow pump and a mixed flow pump is just that's like your Berkeleys and your Dominators. Uh, they're just a more hot snot pump. You can uh, put a place diverter on it, throw a rooster tail, and I decided that's the route I wanted to go. So I actually went out to Connecticut at the end of August and picked up a 1984 Nordic bubble deck with a 454 and a Dominator jet drive. But of course, it's all in pieces and I have to put it back together. Um, so we're going to be covering that on the channel here, uh, but also I've been picking up some other projects here because I just don't have any more sense than that. And uh, we just recently picked up a 1976 Camaro that I went all the way to Southern California for. It is a absolutely beautiful rust-free car. It's got the original quarters on it, original floor. There, it is absolutely amazing how solid this car is. Um, so we went out there, picked it up for 6500 bucks, and then I bought a Lincoln Navigator for $3,800 to tow it home with, um, even though the Camaro ran and drove. Um, and it probably would have made it home, but the heater core was bypassed, and there were some other little things there that I decided, you know what, I am just going to take and put it on a car dolly and tow it home. And I pulled the drive shaft out and plugged the transmission output shaft, and... Uh, went that way um, versus trying to drive it home uh, as much fun as I think that would have been. So, got that. So, you got a 76 Camaro California car. It's a L Type LT. Uh, it has the Smog Dog 305 in it with a whopping, I think, 125 or 140 horsepower. It's bad. I mean, I, I drove it from Azusa down to Diamond Bar, which is uh, about a 25-30 minute drive. And it's slow. I mean, but it ran and drove actually relatively good. Uh, so that's a good solid start is having something that runs and drives. Um, so we're going to be going through that a bunch on this channel. And uh, we're going to be doing an engine swap on it. We're going to be building a 383 stroker. We're putting that in it. We're going to be repainting it. Uh, doing a bunch of other stuff here. So stay tuned. There's some really cool stuff coming to this channel. I'm trying to do updates weekly again. Um, I've been really slack in the last six months, you know, but that's sometimes how life goes. So we're going to catch you on the flip side. We'll see you soon.